Hey guys, I hope you are doing well. So as I promised on part one, I'm back with uh, Atletico Madrid chat. So yes, <laughs> it's interesting. So and in the back you can see my workstation and my March by Amazon dashboard. So yes, I made 26 sales uh, for the day so far, and let's see how it goes and how it ends. And so yeah, um, before starting with uh, part four of this live niche research uh, episodes. Uh, I want to mention here a few facts. When I started with Mars by Amazon, uh, I faced a lot of hustle and a lot of uh, obstacles. Like uh, the main and uh, f uh, and most uh, important fact that I have uh, realized uh, during my earlier stage or earlier phase of Mars by Amazon is that uh, you never know where to start the research, and that's the ultimate problem for the beginners with, with Mars by Amazon. I know, uh, I believe most of you will agree with me on in this regard, so let me know in the comment section below. So, uh, people who are uh, just starting with March by Amazon and who are at tier 10, uh, they have just uh, 10 slots, limited slots to, uh, to uh, start with. And those 10 slots uh, should be the best ones uh, of your uh, findings or your research. So. And uh, the research is very much important here, uh, guys, to uh, capitalize those uh, limited 10 slots. So, yes, uh, the first f problem that we face uh, in the earlier uh, stage of uh, March by Amazon is obviously niche research. And the second one is uh, the uh, trademark and uh, infringement ideas. So, if you are not uh, enough experienced and um, enough uh, conscious about those things, you will lose the long-term opportunity guys I, I, i'm telling again this is a long-term game and this is a huge opportunity if you have access to march by amazon if you have access to create contents from march by amazon you have a big uh, platform already in your hand now you just need to learn a lot and then start with the journey start with the business and start earning money so i won't continue this discussion further uh, now let's get back to my screen and start with part four of this uh, series hello guys so welcome back to my screen so uh, as we discussed on part three uh, we will go with world mental health day to find uh, our profitable sub niche so to do that um, uh, uh, we, we will need to start with amazon research so uh, let me mention you something guys um, you might be thinking um, some tools like uh, merch informer and other things are necessary to do research like uh, some paid tools but um, I want to uh, assure you about this thing, guys. Um, I uh, recently I hardly use those paid tools. I mean, I I'm not using those often. Yes, those are very much helpful and might be necessary in some cases. But when you're just beginning with March by Amazon and you are in tier ten, just forget about about those uh, paid tools. You're uh, you are good to go with just the Amazon dot com website itself and some of the extensions from uh chrome so uh, don't worry about any of the uh paid tools just go with the basic things you have and these are more than enough to start with now uh uh let me mention you some uh, extensions that you might need on your chrome browser so first uh, uh, uh chrome Am um, extension you will be needing you will need is the ds amazon quick view so just type ds amazon quick view on Google, you will find the extension. So this is the extension. I will um, leave a link of this in the uh, description box. So just add this to your Chrome. I have already added this to my Chrome, so I, I, I don't need to add this again. And you can also add uh, another uh, extension to your browser that is product or dashboard. It's so much helpful and it shows a lot of details in, uh, in the research uh, phase, uh, in the uh, browsing pages of Amazon. But um, I think uh, we can just start with the DS Amazon Quick View, and that will uh, that will just um, uh, do our job uh, for the timing. So now uh, let's start with uh, Amazon's.com search bar and type mental health shirt because that is our broad niche or main uh, keyword that we have just uh, uh, prioritized and ranked via Google Trend. So let's type mental health shirt and see what it brings. So first thing first, you need to make sure uh, and keep an eye on is these uh, results. So you can see here, it's showing now 
over 2000 results that means the the keyword we have just typed on amazon it's 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 it's, it's, it's a bigger one like it has a lot of uh, search uh, it has a lot of uh, product uh, ranges uh, with this keyword so uh, we need to make it narrow and we need to go down and down to have uh, a low competition niche so like you can see here uh, it, it is already showing some of the keywords that people are already typing to buy uh, mental health shirts so the left column is the by default uh, keywords uh, shown by amazon himself amazon itself uh, but the other keywords here you can see these are actually uh, um, uh, brought uh, by using a chrome extension that is called amz suggestion, suggestion expander so, so whenever you are starting with the research keep in your mind that um, uh, the our ultimate go goal is to find a phrase because phrases are always uh, uh, selling in good amount in any niche so each and every niche have some good phrases that are selling well so um uh, so if um, uh, if we can find a good phrase that has low competition i think that will be the best option to go for us so let's see if we can find a good phrase uh, from the mental health chart so you can see a few of the uh, suggestions already explained here one is uh, stop the stigma stop the stigma mental health chart i will open that in a new tab and another suggestion came here is end the stigma and you can see another suggestion is uh, break the stigma so we have got three phrases uh, with the word stigma in the mental health chart niche so uh, we'll just keep them uh, aside for a while and we'll go through the first page that we searched uh, at the very beginning and see what are already uh, selling here uh, like hotcakes so you can see uh, mental health matters i think it is one of the most common phrases in the mental health niches and this is something that looks a little bit unique uh, don't judge what you don't understand mental health so uh, this looks to me a little bit unique so i will uh, keep that in a separate tab for further research now let's move on with the uh, page it says uh, broken crayons i'm not sure about the uh, word crayon here so i will just um, give it a search separately on uh, google uh, okay so i think it's, it's, it's something uh, that refers to these things so i think it's it's not a problem it's it's, it's, it's it represents the colors so uh let's keep this also in our list for a while and you can see here it's okay not to be okay and you can see another one your feelings are valid so i will keep these things in uh, my tabs so yeah uh, let me mention one thing to you guys when you are studying with merge by amazon research uh, guys be prepared to to be used to with uh, a lot of Google, uh, chrome tabs because uh, uh, you need to use a lot of chrome tabs uh, to maintain your workflow and this is something where uh, I find this research uh, process a little bit crazy, but uh, interesting at the same time. So uh, I will now uh, continue further in the first page and see what uh, other phrases are already selling. So you can see, be kind to your mind, mental health matters. So I will also keep that in our list and mental health matters. I won't go for this one actually because uh, you can uh, understand that uh, mental health matters is a very common phrase and it will have a lot of uh, products already. So we want to, we don't want to compete in a higher volume of products where we will need to uh, struggle to get the first sale. So let's uh, move on. Uh, you can see here, it's okay not to be okay. And um, uh, they are just selling it's okay not to be okay, but they have added the end this and the stigma. I think they are, actually trying to mess with the um, um, keyword optimization and guys don't do this uh, uh, just mention the words that you are selling uh, in your design don't mention the other words uh, because Amazon already have uh, given some instruction regarding the keywords and listing things so be uh, be um, transparent with your process guys so yes another uh, phrase here tomorrow needs you and you can see here American flag in uh, is crossed with one of the phrases of mental health and it says no one fights alone USA flag so I will also keep this in our list so um, 
when you go through the list you will find a lot this is why the niche research process is actually a time taking process it's not a matter of minutes so uh, i hope you guys will be a little bit patient and uh, be with me till the end of the video now let's move on with the list uh, see if we have uh, more niches i mean sub niches here so and uh, mental health warrior unbreakable so i will keep this in the list and this one we already have seen in the first uh, top result and uh, so um, it's already taken so yes uh, we are done with first space uh, i will just uh, proceed with the results of the first space for a while now so let's see if we can uh, have a sub niche uh, from the already filtered uh, sub niches and if they are already profitable and in low competition